Adam Lerner, BrooklynPhotoWorks.com, and welcome to another Squarespace website portfolio review. If you would like to submit your website for review, just use the link below, send me your website, and I will check it out. Also, if you guys are looking to set up a Squarespace website of your very own, use the code ADAM to save 10%, or use the link squarespace.com slash Adam, and you will save 10% on your Squarespace website. How cool is that? All right, so today we have a very nice website from a Greek photographer. Ooh, um, and it's got a really very nice professional um, commercial look to it. So let's dive right in and take a look. All right, we've got Costas Sohortis, and I'm probably pronouncing that completely incorrectly. Um, you know, I don't see a lot of, uh, of websites from folks that are from Greece, but I think that that's, that's really cool. In fact, uh, my wife and I go to Greece every year. How lucky are we? Um, anyway, so here we are. We're at Costas' website, and um, right off the bat, I see very professional work. I see work for the museum. I see work for Cosmo Tay, which is one of the cell phone carriers over there. Um, you know, this looks really cool. I'm not really sure what it is. Very nice, very nice portrait of this gal. Beautifully lit, nicely edited. You know, everything, ha look at the barbecue place, like everything has like a very clean, professional, um, very well edited look to it, very intentional looking stuff. Oh man, Fisher, yep, drink that over there, that's for sure. Um, very nice looking um, assemblage of uh, still life. You know, there's a real nice still life shot right here. Uh, what else we got? So we got a whole bunch of stuff here. All right, so you know what? I'm going to go back up to the top. Actually, you know what's interesting? When you go over every one of these deals, it kind of gives you a sense of what it is. So why don't we do that? Why don't we go and see Ogilvy and Mather Grease? Boom. And uh, Samelli Wine. So I guess he shot this for them. Yeah, you know, look, these are fine. I mean, you can see some of the backdrop here. I don't know if that's something that he wanted or if he wanted it to have that paper look. Um, you know, the interesting thing is that once you actually drill into one of these, it kind of looks like a blog post. Let's see the yuka, ukulele. Hey, ukulele. Um, this is a lookbook. Um, yeah, these are really nice, you know, nicely edited, nicely shot. The framing is great. The color balance is really terrific. It's very even. It's very balanced. Um, you know, great expressions out of this model. Um, really, really, really super nice stuff. I mean, you know, and I even, I don't mind this. You know, this is a little bit of kind of a fun improvisational shot at the end here. But um, it definitely has that, um, that blog post feel, which is nice. I don't mind that. We'll see the Ogilvy and Mary Cosmote. Um, so that might be just a one and done. Yeah. And I guess when you go into this, if you don't have a big um, a gallery behind it, then it kind of takes you in and it goes, you know, individual image by image. So there's definitely a good bit of editing going on in Photoshop here, but that's what's allowing or, or that's what's enabling Costas to get the, uh, the advertising work and the advertising clients that he has. Because if we go over to the about page, you can see that he's got, you know, some decent clients and some decent agencies that he works for. So good on you. Uh, let's look at the portrait section. Same kind of a deal. Um, it says Minetti Spring, and uh, you know it's a nice, appealing portrait. Uh, looks like a lookbook, so um, I don't mind that he calls it portrait, even though it is, you know, actually a fashion lookbook uh, section. Very nicely shot. Nice editing, clean. The tones are all there. There's consistency throughout. There's a point of view. Um, it definitely plays very nicely. And it's the kind of thing that, you know, as an art director, um, as a, you know, an art buyer, that you could look at his work and say, you know what, I see, I see what I could do with that. Okay, we've got, interestingly, we've got personal work mixed in here, so let's see this one. Oh, that's just one shot, so we don't, this, oh, here we go. Let me just try to get back where I was. You know, in fact, I'm just gonna go back to the portrait gallery. Um, ALD Architects Corporate Portrait. Okay, we've got that one, that one. This one has a kind of a flat look comparatively, um, but the expression's nice as far as the editing goes. That one's nice, that's okay. 
I mean, what I feel about a gallery like this is that you could take the the um, layout portrait and maybe one other rather than having like all of them, you know, kind of there. The uh, fitness stuff, you know, looks good. Everything kind of has like a lot of these have like a little bit of a haze to them. I wonder if that's intentional. In fact, I'm sure it is. I'm sure that this is something that Costas does in Photoshop, you know, or something wherever he edits. But I'm not create. I, I want them to punch a little bit more rather than, than kind of flattening. But look, they're nicely shot. They're nicely edited. Uh, there's definitely a commercial component to these. Um, it looks like you do a lot of work for Minetti, which I guess is this men's fashion brand. So I wonder if maybe all of the Minetti stuff should just be under a lookbook section. Um, more personal work, just a one and done right there. Oh, here we go. Sorry about that, guys. I'm just trying to navigate. Here's another Minetti. Ah, look at this guy, the world's most interesting man. Um, yeah, cool. You know, I kind of dig that look of the uh, kind of the navy shirt with the blue blazer. Kind of, kind of nice. Very cool. Um, let's just keep going here. Yeah, we got a nice portrait. But the interesting thing is, like, again, I, I feel like there's some kind of toning going on here. Kind of, I don't know. It just, I don't know. Maybe it's just a taste level thing. Um, yeah, there's definitely a look. There's definitely a look. And hey, look. You're allowed to have your own look, you know? These are fun, these are nice. I find the, the uh, navigation a little bit aggravating. I don't like having to do so much clicking. I guess I could maybe, you know, use, oh look, she's grabbing her boob, uh-oh. Um, that's kind of an interesting shot. So there's a nice collection of stuff in here. Um, yeah, the, the photos doesn't really resize. That's one thing that, you know, you would not have out of a Squarespace site. Um, I'll show you in a second, hang on. So for example, um, you know, if we go into my site, which uh, let's pop in there, boom. Um, yeah, I mean, look, we can just look at this photo, you know, you see how it's resizing? See how it's doing like that, guys? Okay, that's really, really nice. Um, I don't like how that these images here, they don't resize. It just kind of shifts over and then it's done. Um, all right, cool. So we'll. Close out of that, um, we'll go back to the top, we'll go to the blog. So the blog looks like it's kind of, uh, you know what it is? It's it, The blog and the website are one. Um, I don't necessarily know if we need the blog as its own thing, um, unless there's stuff in the blog that's maybe not in, because um, you know when it says read more, um, it basically just gives you maybe a handful of more images there's not really any kind of a description or a story, but um, yeah, maybe the blog's a little bit informative. Look, all of these, this is good imagery. You know, this is nice jewelry shots. It all works. Um, there's some really nice stuff going on here. Let's just go to the about page. Oh, he already was there. He's uh, interested in people and places and expressions, yada, yada. Let's check out Costas' uh, Instagram. Okay, so he's got a lot of the lookbook stuff. He's got some behind the scenes. I love that. That's a really neat shot. I think that one's also on the website as well. Um, in fact, I'm gonna give Costas a follow. Boom, there we go. And there you have it. So, there we go. All right, Costas, really nice job. I mean, you're doing some very, very solid commercial work. Um, I find that the layout and the, the navigation of this website's a little bit aggravating. Um, you know, there's a lot of clicking around and like things aren't really connected. And like if I'm in one thing and I go back, it takes me back to another thing. It doesn't really have that kind of beautiful, cohesive flow of a Squarespace website. But then again, you know what? You've done a great job by narrowing down your best work. There's, there's not redundancy in here. There's a very good representation. So for example, if I was looking to hire you, I would get a very, very good idea of the quality of the work that you're able to produce. And I get that even just from the very, the landing page when I can scroll down and look at all this kind of work and see that there's, there's a really nice range. Everything is, you know, got nicely framed, nice lighting, nice editing, et cetera, et cetera. So good job, Costas and uh, Calimera to you. Uh, there you go, guys. So if you guys would like to submit your website uh, for review, just use the link below. That's it for now, and we'll see you soon.